Is it going to hurt? No. I don't feel pain. Is it a needle? It's a pin. Yeah, it'll do it. Then I have... Oh, good though. You're right. Did it hurt? It was really sore, but it's okay. I know you're having a lot of fun. You're a shocker. I can wet this through. Um, it's just going to focus. There's quite a bit of blood, is it? Well, I wouldn't recommend you donate this week. That's good. Away, I wasn't planning on it. I'm pleased my blood's red. Look at that guy. I just don't want to put too big a hole in it so that it gets... Mainly water. Oh, Gee, he's one to know down Frank. in the race as well. Frank. He's got a real sharp turn of foot, GC. He's come from a, a long way off them there, and he's he's sprinted strongly. So uh, he's a type you want to be following out of the race. It's a, it's a race you want to follow and really break down a number of times. I'm looking forward to looking over that race again and even having a look at some of these other horses back in the field. And even our curious was a horse who was back uh, deep on the inside and was doing his best work uh, over the concluding stages. But a top win uh, by no filter. You can see your blood all over you. Might hear from the bookmakers as well once I've um, adjusted markets to see what that horse was in the 2,000 guineas and what, what's going to happen uh, in terms of those markets because you always see a drop in price after a, a win like that. But a nice win too. This one for Richard Collett and son-in-law Andrew Corder in the saddle. That's the running of the third. We'll take a break and then on the other, on the other side, we'll be back with Mark Crookson. I'm looking to try and buy So that's going to dry up in a couple of days and then I'll be able to lift it off. Cool. Apparently. That's why that's just weird. Australian Group 1 winner. Thank you very much. Blood bath. Something else there. Uh. 
Ja. Ja.